Hello, uh, my name is David Hale. I'm an enrollment coach here at San Antonio College. So today what we're gonna be doing is going over three uh, major holds that seem to get our students caught up. Um, these are the bacterial meningitis, the TSI test, and the Alamo enroll modules. So I'm gonna go over these pretty quickly so you can see what you need to do and uh, get you moving forward through the enrollment process. So first thing I'm gonna do is share my screen. Here we go. So um, two of these holds are conveniently located in your ACEs account. So we're just gonna go, the way that I always get there is just Google SAC or San Antonio College and ACEs. Gonna click that first one. Now I'm already signed in, so it let me get right into the ACEs page. But from this page, what you're gonna do is on the left, you'll see home. You just wanna go underneath there to start here. Go ahead and click that. Now, a lot of great information is on that page, but like I said, we're gonna be focusing on the Alamo and Roll modules and the bacterial meningitis. So right here, we already see the bacterial meningitis. So um, if you wanna submit your forms, all you have to do is click this button here. And, whoops. You'll see uh, the three options right here. So option one, if you have a PDF, a digital version, you can upload that PDF here. If you have a physical version of your vaccination record with a bacterial meningitis shot on it, what you can do is take a picture on your phone, um, come to this website on your phone and upload that picture. That'll work as well. But um, when you click this button, this is what it looks like. And you can you know, choose your home college, upload the file right here, and then just submit. Now, another option that we have um, that's pretty common is the online courses only waiver. So if you're only gonna take online courses, that means you're not planning on stepping foot on the campus, you can go ahead and fill, on, fill in the online courses only waiver. This will make it so that way we don't need your bacterial meningitis, um, but as stated, you also would need to take only online courses. Um, the third option, uh, well, option two here, is the immunization waiver. So if you cannot get the vaccination due to health issues um, or something like that, then um, you can get your physician to fill out a form and you can upload that form through option two. And that's really all there is to the bacterial meningitis. So it's really quick, really easy. Um, so hopefully you can get that going. Um, next thing on the list, Alamo enroll. So for the Alamo enroll modules, if you have an Alamo enroll hold, what it's talking about is this right here. So you can see it on the page. It's talking about two and three. So number two is the GoFar module, which just talks to you a little bit about college life. To click it, you'll see here on mine, it says complete, but down here, he says click here. So like it says for me here, it would say for you right here. So again, it would, this number two would say click here. You can click that once you complete it, you get a check mark. So for um, these holds, you just need to complete numbers two and number three, the test prep module. Now the test prep module kind of leads in to uh, the third hold we're gonna talk about, which is the TSI. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. So I'm gonna go back to uh, our main page here. This is just uh, San Antonio College main site. So what I'm gonna do is come over here to the search and I'm going to look for assessment, A-S-S-E-S-S-M-E-N-T. -S -S First thing that pops up is the assessment center. That's the correct one. So if you need to take the TSI test, this is where you need to be. So you can do either on campus limited seating currently. Um, I'm not sure how long that'll last, but we also have the TSI from home. So if you want to take it from home, you click this button and it gives you all the steps for taking the TSI at home. And after you read over everything, you can just click this button here and that'll get you started. So let's go ahead and click. And we can see here, um, these are the email addresses you can reach out to if you need some assistance. It tells you right here what you're gonna need, a computer with a high internet speed connection, a webcam, 
a room with no distractions, registration with Examity, and a proctor fee. So if I click next, and here's what you're going to need. Your banner ID, first name, last name, date of birth, your address, city, country, state, postal code, uh, email address. You do want to use your Alamo email address. Just get into the habit of using your student email for everything and a phone number. After you finish that, um, you'll need to pay for the exam. Once you pay, you'll get the voucher and the voucher will have the uh, test time and other information on it. But the voucher only comes after you pay. So be sure to pay first or else you'll just be waiting for nothing. But that pretty much concludes that. So once again, this is how you get rid of that TSI hold. And we'll go back to here. Again, I just went to home on my ACE account. Click start here. Bacterial meningitis is located right here. And Alamo enroll number two and three are right here. Um, if you have any other issues, um, you can always reach out to us at the Virtual Welcome Center. Again, if you just go to the main site, you can click Apply Register Today, this button. And this has all of our contact information. So if you want to go to the Virtual Welcome Center and get some Zoom help, it's right here. If you want to contact a coach, you can click this button right here. Um, that about cuts it for today. If you have any other questions, like I said, please reach out to us. Uh, I hope this was informational. We're going to be coming out with more videos over holds and different things and how to fix them in the future. Currently, we have this one, and there is also a video that goes over um, how to apply. So if you need help with your Apply Texas, we do have a video on our YouTube account with that information. Go ahead and check it out. Anyway, have a great day. Again, my name is David Hale, and hope to see you soon in the Virtual Welcome Center. Thank you.